Hi guys, so it's Shirley, your girl from Rose Day Please. And yes guys, I've got my pretty face on. I quite literally was just filming another video and I thought, yes, your girl needs to keep up with her people for real, for real, right? Because I know you're all like, uh, so she said to expect videos and these videos kind of never came, right? So basically, guys, sorry, bear with me, happy new year, by the way, I know we are way into the new year, but your girl's busy, and I am, like, so sorry, but so much going on, and I don't mean for you not to be the ones that kind of miss out and all of that, because it's so mean, and I know you're all probably like, for real, girl, like, it can't really take you away from us that much, can it? You'd be surprised. So, saying that, there's been so much going on, guys. Family, uni, like, me. <laughs> but what more can I say, right? Like, gotta keep it real. And at this stage in life, what more can we really ask for other than for it to just go smoothly? Um, so much more to come out of... Um, Rose Dairy Freeze this year. Simply, the reason I say there's a lot to come out of us this year is that I'm working on a new notion um, when it comes to the bacon. Um, the reason I say a new notion, guys, is that I think there are areas in which could possibly um, kind of help benefit uh, Rose Dairy Freeze, if you want me to be honest with you. Um, because I'm starting to realize I've got so many friends at uni that are basically like very intolerant and it's just like come on girl these are your people you need to look after them i don't just do dairy free stuff i do vegan stuff um so i can eliminate milk the eggs like all the bits where you're just like oh god tolerate this or i can do the gluten free stuff and i'm like i should quite possibly be really talking to a lot of these people because they might be like Oh girl, what are you doing? Right. But uh, because I'm focusing a lot more at the moment and presently on my music career, I am trying to get my um, solo career up. It's just like, really, uh, you need to keep up with everything. Um, saying that though, guys, it's a busy, busy life when you're a mum and doing all of this, right? So I know y'all get me because a lot of people that are probably watching this are parents when they've got that stolen moment from their child. I feel you. I do. I love y'all. Literally, I do because I know you all understand. So if you like anybody else that's watching this understand the craziness of being a mum, being a student, working for Trahasa me. Those are the things that will get you. So I'm going to try and keep up a lot of videos where I do my makeup for you, Slot. Not always, but I will. I'll also show you these bad boys because um, I don't just choose the colours. My kids do as well. They love seeing me that like, kind of pamper myself. And same goes for my hair because girls go natural for a little bit. You used to see me up with all different kinds of colours in my hair. Yes, but uh, I've gone natural for a bit, which is a little bit strange for me. Because I'm just like, oh my god, I've got no colour in my hair. But then I'm like, oh, there's colour in my hands, so I can enjoy the colour in my hands. Um, I'm gonna start to do a QA and a um, for my page. I'm gonna do a webinar for this page, guys. The reason I'm choosing to do a webinar for this page is because I think there's a lot to be learnt out of being dairy intolerant. Not everybody understands it. And I, I say not everybody understands it because some people are like, oh, but why can't you eat this? Or, oh, you make it so difficult when it goes out. And I understand because as a parent, we have these issues that just make our life so difficult. 
that we go out and we're like, oh, God, like, why are you making it so hard for me? And it's not because we make people's life hard. It's because, guys, we are who we are. Nobody can do anything about it, right? You need to let them know that, first of all. There's nothing they can do about it. They just have to vibe with it. Because you didn't design you. You just took the body you was given. Please let them know this. You didn't create yourself. So we're going to be talking about dietary needs um, this year. Um, as someone that is dairy intolerant, we are also going to talk about being lactose intolerant. We are going to talk about eliminating dieting and all the scary bits in between and all the bits where you are worried and the bits where someone says to you oh why don't you try this and you're just a little bit like but i have and they try to tell you well i'll go back and try it again oh because it worked for me not everything that works for somebody else will work for you please remember that like don't let nobody push you into having something in your diet and you don't feel comfortable with it if you don't feel comfortable you don't feel comfortable don't do it because it could result in you ending up in hospital it can result in you being really ill for long periods of time and it's so unnecessary to be in that situation it doesn't make any sense put yourself out for no one else please understand that if you have other questions that you feel that I might be able to help you with even doing your pretty thighs, even when it comes to people that do here, or some of the styles that you've seen me with, because some of the styles, like this one I decided to do, because I had my hair recently done in a bomb-ass weave, yeah, your girl had a wicked-ass lace front wig on, and I was slaying the shit out of that, I'm not gonna lie, um, but I'm telling you a lot this because I think it's time for me to be a little bit more interactive with Rose Dairy Free and Foods. Um, the reason I'm choosing to do this um, this year is because we haven't been in business for long. But I know there must be some questions about some of the stuff that I do. Because I recently did um, some for somebody at my uni. And she was like, oh, like, she's like, I asked her what she doesn't tolerate and whatever. And I think... Some people assume that all dairy-free people um, are the same. And that's not true. Right? You with me? Yes. So, we are going to touch on a lot of points this year. So, what I'm going to start doing is, um, I'll only probably post maybe once to twice a week. That's only because with um, posting here, it means I have to work doubly um as hard because i'm putting up like two on the other side i thought it's gonna be two for here but i will what i will start doing is recording the next video to go up straight after this and then there'll be no excuse unless we all drop into a big black hole or i'm severely ill or my hands start working or i physically can't move i will try and make sure that i have a video for you i may even do like my makeup whilst i'm on the video with you um, I don't solely show the products that I use, that's because I just go with any range of stuff. I am a drugstore beauty girl because sometimes spending all that damn money is just like, really? Am I really going to spend all that money? And I can still do all of this with the drugstore beauty products. If you do want to know some of the products that I'm using, then do please leave a message for me and I will most definitely let you know what I'm using. Because some of them I've had for maybe two years. Some I've recently bought because like my makeup was running low and I needed to fix that. Yes. But um, I will happily part with you up here. The music you can hear in the back is my music from Stage Light Records. That's right. Your girl is running to business. So, if you want to jump on that page and listen to my music and share it, please do. It's Stage Light Records and Private Tutoring on YouTube. The reason it's so damn long is just because I'm not the only Stage Light Records out there. But, um, I might try and address the name in a while. Um, 
maybe at some point this year I'll probably try shorting it to like an abbreviation but um I'm going to be doing a lot more for, for use up this year so please do get at me um you can follow me on Facebook you can follow me on Insta and y'all follow me on YouTube because I've got so much to do for use up this year the webinars I will be charging a set fee but before we get into that um, it won't be done until probably the end of March. Bear with me, guys. I'm going to get to you on that, innit? And, you know, because, like, we kind of in February already because January felt, like, kind of hella long, for real. For real, for real. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, basically, um, look for the webinars to pop up for Rose Dairy Free around the end of March. Don't quote me on that. I say the end of March. I might do it in the middle of March. I might bring the date forward if um, things go my way. So, I'm going to leave it there with y'all. I love my dairy free, my lactose free, my nut free people, my gluten free. What a free, whatever free we are, baby. We free from the stress of the fucking world because guess what? They hitting us with the tax on our food, innit? Yeah. I know y'all hear me on that. I know you hear me. I know you hear me. But I will see you all next week. Please look out for the video. Please like and share this bad boy. And I will see you all later. Peace out. Mwah.